Hello. Hello. <laughs> Uh, hello and welcome, you join me, ADG. I'm just doing that rather stupidly because uh, I never know when these broadcasts, when you're streaming, actually start. So I might miss my intro there even. So anyway, I'm back once again on Dirt Rally 2 for yet another, seems to be all I do at the moment, um, time trial event for the MRC. So I'll, every single time I feel like I have to uh, explain the MRC is the Mature Racing Club, which is a Facebook group. Um, it's a group for league racing. So, for example, there's an, a Mature Racing Group for Gran Turismo, which uh, organises league racing and all sorts of other stuff and all sorts of other content con consider concerned with Gran Turismo. And then, uh, I should really think about what I'm going to say before I say all this. Uh, and then there's uh, MRC Dirt Rally 2 group as well. So it's the same group, it's Mature Racing Club, but it's Dirt Rally 2 uh, focusing just on Dirt Rally 2, quite obviously. So um, each week there's a time trial event put up by a guy called Andy Withers, which uh, seems to run these time trials uh, on the Dirt Rally 2 group through the MRC. Uh, and this week it's New England, USA, Beaver Creek Trail Forward, which almost sounds rude. Uh, it's daytime dry, and if we have a quick look at the distance of the stage, it's 7.99 miles on the bottom right there, with an elevation change of just over 100 foot, uh, and it's medium gravel, heavy gravel. So, the bit that concerns me out of those three little figures, or stats, is the 7.99 miles that's a long stage rallying's hard <laughs> as simple as that i'm not going to dress it up with any more language than that rallying rallying is hard and 7.99 miles isn't actually very long for a proper rally but in dirt rally too it's a bloody long one so we're in the opal manta whoever's picked this i've never driven this car before so you probably have the good laugh so 275 brake horsepower, 2,161 pounds in weight. Uh, engine is a 2,410 cc. I don't know why I've just skipped to that. Uh, four cylinders, naturally aspirated, and it's a five-speed manual gearbox. And it's rear-wheel drive, and it falls in the Group B rear-wheel drive category. So if we look at my... Uh, oh, no, no, what am I doing? If we look at info, how do I do that? Oh, pedals. Uh, a Group B icon, the Opel Manta, was entered in mid-1983. It struggled to match its four-wheel drive competitors with an all-wheel drive Opel Manta prototype being developed briefly before the project was brought to a close. The Opel Manta Group B produced 275 horsepower, offering excellent traction in the dry. So, hopefully that can be believed. And I'll see how I get on with this car. These can end up turning into very embarrassing streams, just watching really bad driving. And I think to myself, oh God, I wish I'd have practiced before I started and done uh, done it after a bit of practice. But at the same time, goes to show how hard it is. I'm no expert at these games, don't consider myself very, uh, very good. Uh, I'm, I'm competent to a point. Um, but yeah, I'm not absolutely amazing. So I just try and aim to get better every single time I play it, that's all, and learn something walk away or turning off my playstation thinking yeah i've kind of sussed that car out and uh, yeah that felt really good and uh whatever whatever i always like to walk away feeling like even if it hasn't gone very well i've learned something and uh i can possibly learn something along the way so anyway i'm literally just going to try and get through the stage to start with on this first run feels like i'm gonna have to shout because it's pretty loud Oh god. A six right long. Of a crest, 15, so the steering's actually left. pretty. I was expecting it to be uh, Don't cut three right quite understeer, but it's actually quite pointy. Keep right a which is good. Three left. Definitely cut Didn't into the apex is quite well with it straight away. So that's good to know. I like jumping into a new car I've never driven right. and just giving it a go. 30. Four left over crest, where's the foot bit though? 30. Keep 
middle of a crest. 15. Right left. And oh. six right. Oh, nearly into the wall there over that crest. Six right. Upwards keep middle of a crest. And a keep right into four left. 150. That feels good. Well, I like it already. Right. It Give me no major issues straight away. So I'm sure it will when I start pushing. Right. A bit harder, but at the moment it feels quite comfortable to drive. Where am I going? Oh, oh. got confused there where the corner was. Thought it was the junction just before it. So it broke and then messed up the actual corner as well. Sudden turn two right, eighty. Turn one right long of a double junction. Where am I going? Uh, it's a bit confusing that little bit. Opens into six left long. Titans turn heavy left. Opens flat to the crest long. 30. Six left. And turn four right. 40. Six right to the oh crest. God. Slow 50. Turn very tight heavy left. See where the trouble is in this car now. The uh, like four left to right, the weight transfer. Oh God, no! The weight transfer between those is uh, is proving pretty tricky. I don't feel like I'm really driving with any real aggression so far, I'm just trying to get through the stage, like I say. I've already made a few mistakes, but first run through the stage, I've ever been through it. I might have done in the past, I can't remember, it's not, it doesn't seem familiar to me. That went a bit wrong. Managed to attach it and gather it up though. Oh no. Couldn't quite see the corner then. So I'm getting to the point where I'm about halfway through now. Left of a crest jump, 50, slow, by right, 40, turn, oh, no. very tight, hairpin right. Oh, I've got a bit of a bump just before I went into that jump. Turn, very tight, hairpin left, don't cut. 120. Oh, that's Six terrible into that. Opens of a crest, 50. So this isn't one that I'm going to want to restart very often. I want to just be clean the whole way through. It's been such a long stage, you don't really want to be starting all the time and going from the beginning every time because you might have a brilliant start and then mess it up later on anyway. So. Oh, that's tightened up on me. Oof, just to manage to get away without hitting that. But very, very slow. The wire broke so much for a six right, I've lost confidence. Into six right of a dip and crest and caution. Four left of a crest. Opens 40. Four left. Open six. To keep right of a jump. Cut right left. 60. Six right. Oh no, 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 oh. So I did quite a good job there, believe it or not, even though I spun it. 
I uh, managed to avoid, I was that close to the inside that there was rocks on the inside so I managed to counter steer to avoid the rocks but spun it because of it so I considered that quite good actually because I didn't actually hit the rocks buried in the grass which was what I was trying to do but couldn't quite manage everything that I needed to do to uh, keep under control for it Tricky to see through here, I think, on this stage. Oh, what? No! Oh, that's good in. Wait, he? Oh. oh, no. That's not good. Go like C in the corner when I come over a jump. It makes me panic. Left of a crest, Hello. Very long. Opens Six right. Turn unseen. Struggling to see proper through here now. Oh, that's lit on the brakes. Oh, God's sake. Oh, no, it's probably my worst mistake so far in this stage. And there's been a few little ones, but, oh, come on. I don't know what's there on the inside, but I can't get past it. Oh, uh, massive time loss. Uh, at least it's only my first run through the stage, but... Right at the end as well, it turns out. I haven't really been paying attention to how far through the surge it was. And there you go, it's right at the end. So an 8.21.587. So that was just trying to... Oh, 16 seconds worth of penalties. Oh, I'm feeling sick. Uh, well, I can definitely improve on that quite easily just by driving the stage. That's all I was trying to do, but it's a tricky one. Being that long, I'm not. I'm not the best. I will confess, I'm not the best at the longest stages. Inevitably, I do seem to lose my concentration a little bit at some point. But all in all, what I can take from that first run is that car feels all right, uh, and I can certainly go quicker. So I can get used to the car more and more. If I look on my uh, friends list as well, we've got Captain Slow, AJW there that's already put in a 736.327, so it's well, I'm going to say about 50 seconds, but it's there on the side, 45.26 seconds quicker than me. Whew. So I've got a lot of work to do. Like I say, this, that was the first time I've ever driven this car through that stage, so I, I, I haven't done well, don't get me wrong, but I don't think I've done too badly either at the same time. It could have been a lot worse, put it that way. A few mistakes, I lost my time, and... Um, time loss because of just not being fully in tune with the car and trusting it completely. I don't know how many runs I'm going to have because it's an eight mile stage. So it's an eight minute time or thereabouts, so over seven minutes for a fast time for a wheel by the look of it. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be one that I don't attempt too much I don't think. It'll eat up my day. Oh, the stage straight away. Opens up a crest, 50, four left. It don't cut three right long of a crest. Keep right of a 40, three left. Oh. Into two right. Just touched Very the grass long. then and Passed back end went on it. Opens 30, three right, 30. Ooh. Oh, I could definitely uh, drive this car quite well once to get used to it. It's really quite tail happy, which I quite like in these rally cars, on the gravel especially. Keep middle of a crest and to keep right to the ball left. 
150. All right. Into slow. Six now. 30. Turn unseen. One right. Six slow. Six left. Opens 100. Turn unseen. Square left. Oh, I did the same thing last time. Turn one left. Opens three long. Sudden turn two right. 80. Oh, 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 turn oh, oh, oh. one right long of a double junction. Opens into six left long. Titans turn hey, why? left. Flat of a long, 30. Oh, got the tail going around, rotated on me a bit too much. 40, 6 right of a crest, slow 50, turn very tight oh, and left. So easy to lose the tail, it just kicks. 30. Mm. Right long, opens 90. Uh, I've decided I'm going to finish my smoke and then have a go. It's hindering me a little bit. Too many corners to deal with. But just bear with me a second or two. Yeah, I feel like uh, I could hone into this car quite well. You can tilt in the back end quite, uh, like as, pretty much as much as you want on the throttle, so... It's, uh, it's pretty handy as that, when the corners tighten up on you when, when you might have gone in a bit hot. So I'm getting used to the, at the same time. I'm getting it bang on. The easiest car to do that in, in my opinion, is that 1995 Subaru Impreza. It's just, you can just jump in it and be so aggressive in it straight away. And then just turn in so early with the handbrake and just every, every single corner you're sideways going in before you've even got to the corner. Especially on the Sweden stages. Really, really good fun. Recommend it if you haven't tried it. It's really, really good fun, in fact. Um, it feels like a drifting lesson in a way, because you just link one corner to the other, to the other, to the other, and it's just one big pendulum effect. And then it's how you control that with the throttle and the distance between the corners and how you carry the slide, and it's really, really good fun. I don't know if I'm good at it, or if everyone could drive quite well like that, but I really, really enjoy it, because I, I feel like it's quite easy feels really slow and like it's a little ballet you're just dancing the car around it's not actually very fast it's all about the weight transfer though anyway back to this one more pull left i'm rushing now i'm gonna have a right back you rush right here we go <coughs> So we're off again for another run, our second run, full run through the stage. Six right long of a crest, into six left, and six right long, opens up a crest, fifty. Oh, that's a bad, 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 bad start, right. <coughs> Does. Don't want to be restarting. I've done too much of that on these streams. Need to be getting through these stages. Nice and clean. If a little six slow. Long of a crest, into six left. A six right long. Opens up a crest. Fifty. Four left. Into don't cut three right long of a crest. Keep right of a forty. Three left. Into two right. Very long. Pass junction. Opens thirty. Three right. No. Thirty. Oh, it's too sideways to get any more braking done. And so I ended up going that wide. I'm just going too fast into the corner. Oh, keep getting that bit wrong. Same bit. We've only had two runs for it. 
Well, three now, I suppose, for this beginning bit. No. 60. Turn one left. Ooh. Nearly collected the logs on the exit there. And the stores. Turn two right. 80. Oh, turn sloppy. Right sloppy, sloppy, junction. sloppy. Turn Opens into six left long. Titans. Turn happy left. Ooh. It wide on the exit. Opens flat of a crest long 30. Quite technical that section. And turn four right. 40. Six right of a crest. Slow 50. Oh, turn very tight. In the wrong gear there. 30. Four right long. Opens 90. Bit wide on the uh, hairpin. Not too bad though. Carrying the speed and being clean in general. Left of a crest, past junction, 200. Slow, turn unseen, one right. Into five left long, opens a crest. Into six left, 50. I went ultra slow into that and then when I actually went around the corner it was a bit hairy. Oh, what's coming? Just going ultra slow into there, I didn't trust that. I couldn't really see what was coming. No, oh, oh, nearly got on the brakes heavily there just because I got the line wrong. To keep left of a crest and keep middle of a crest at 50. Cut six left long. 100. Don't let the day cut anything at this kind of speed. Left of a crest jump. 50. Slow by right. 40. Turn very tight hairpin right. 100. Oh. Got the braking done early. <laughs> we got the braking done and I just drove nicely into the corner. Oh god, I've missed that instruction. Right, we'll go this way. Into reverse, quick as can. Completely messed that up, but realised straight away, so I got it rectified as quickly as possible. That was bad though, just because I was laughing over the co driver's call. Oh no, I'm all over the place. <laughs> Good way to keep that going. Oh, it doesn't seem like a far right. No, this is the dodgy one for left over crest, sounds bad to me. Ooh, slow into there. To keep right of a jump. And keep right of a crest, 30. Cut by left. Oh no, I just feel like something's going to go wrong here. Let's just calm it down a bit. And six left, and three right tightens. I don't know if I'm the only one, but you get that feeling sometimes when you're rallying. You just feel like something's going to go wrong. Even though there's no sign of it, really. You just feel like you're getting a bit out of control. Some line is going to catch you out at some point. Definitely quite a fun surge to tackle. 
Long. It's a tricky one though, it's a long one like I say. Opens. Oh, cut in a bit too tight, hit the wall. Oh, at least I didn't go off this time. No penalty this time, but I did hit the bridge. Where is it? 80. Left of a crest, oh no. 30. Rotated a bit too far again. Nearly put my point in the wrong way. Keep left of a crest, 50. Lost a little bit of time there. Left of a crest, very long. Opens 150. Six right. 80. Turn unseen. Two right. Opens. 150. Five left of a crest. 30. Five right long. Opens of a finish. Into six left long. Just stop. Oh, that's more like it. 728.954. Have I beaten turn, sir? Can't remember what it's who it was. Uh, AJW or something. 728. Oof, Todd Garton gets your friggin' heart rate going. <laughs> uh, that was quite good. Still a few little mistakes in there. Hit that bloody bridge. But not too bad overall. It's one of them cars where you feel like you can go quicker all the time. But then can you? It's quite an interesting one, actually. I'm enjoying this. Uh, have a look. Way I've beaten him, so 728. So I've put him down by 7.3 seconds. Yeah, so this only just uh, came up this morning. I posted on Facebook that group that was on about uh, the MRC Dirt Rally 2 group on Facebook. Uh, it was only posted this morning to have a go at this. Uh, I'm probably one of the first as well as AJW to have a go, so I'm quite happy with that. I'm, I'm first. For a while, I might have taken a screenshot of that <laughs> until everyone else gets on it and has a go and puts me down by about 30 seconds. But anyway, I might have yet another run because that was quite fun, but I can't believe I've managed to get away with as little mistakes as I've, uh, I've managed, really. A spin round and a reverse here and there, but other than that, I've been pretty clean. So let's try and beat that 728 now. Six right long of a crest. Go go to beat him. Puts up your personal best go, so I've got that to beat. I know if I'm uh, ahead of it, I'm uh, I'm beating it this but of a crest. Keep right of a 40, three left. Getting used to the car more and more as well, so that helps. Just go faster all in all through this beginning section compared to last time. Don't feel like it's any different, but I'm probably just that little bit more in control of the car and carrying that little bit more speed, just because of uh, the long stage I've just done, basically, and the fact that I've got used to the car more and more. I'm, my biggest problem probably is the gears. I keep, uh, I keep getting caught between gears, I find. Oh, wide there this time, but I managed to get away with it. Oh, that is sideways. <laughs> Oh, I was good into there. 60. Turn Not so good into there though. Bit wide. Oh, just missed the logs again on the exit. Playing with those logs. Turn one right long of a double junction. Opens into six left long tightens. Turn heavy left. Gone early on the hairpin. Oh, too early. 
Well, I didn't actually go too early. I powered. I, I tried to get on the power too early. And set the steer unit right. right. We got the turn about right, actually. Oh, sideways for the. Didn't want that to happen. Uh, it's going to drain out. Gears, gears, gears. Please, sort your gears out. Opens long. Six left of a double jump. Into cut. Got that a bit better this time. To keep left of a crest and keep middle of a crest. 50. Cut. Six left long. 100. Keep left of a crest jump. Oh, it's a cut, but Jesus Christ, that's it. that is a cut. Take it fist a bit there. Sorry about the language. Oh, I'm pushing now. I'm all over the place. Oh, I've hit the tree. I've hit the tree. Yeah, that's good. Oh, scrappy, scrappy, but I'm fast. Left of a jump. Oh. oh, it's a whopper. Keep right over 180. No, no. Oh, no. Turn unseen. Ooh, just roll. I didn't break. I just roll off the accelerator and hope they all came good. Oh, getting too excited and talking over the car driver. So that's where it all goes from. Wrong for me when I stop listening to the car driver properly. Still up over a hole, I can't believe it. Oh shit. I can't believe I'm up over a hole. Jesus Christ. This is hairy. <laughs> I can't believe I'm still going. I had a massive, massive, massive moment. Oh. Oh my god. It's heart in my own stuff at the moment. Right. Well, too slow for that. I didn't. I missed it all. Right, I'm listening again. I'm going to focus again. There's my ghost in front of me though. Oh, too many mistakes. Pushing too hard. Keep middle of a crest jump. 50. Six right long. Let's see if I can beat my time on this last bit, even though behind the ghost quite a bit. Oh, not with. That sounded like a puncher to me. We have punched the left rear. Yeah. Ah. Hmm. Right, I'm going to quickly go downstairs and just nip to the toilet and then uh, carry on. Oh, that's annoying.
Oh, that is brutal, <laughs> brutal, but good fun. Right, I'm gonna do what I started doing. And just head to get through the stage, really. And be clean and tidy the whole way, and just make up time that way. Not really push, push to make up time. So that's where the mistakes start coming. And you're all over the place, and you, you lose time by just gathering it up all the time. So instead of doing that, just try and be neat and tidy for the whole thing. Uh, easier said than done, obviously, but that's the aim now. That was just too hairy to actually get away with. That was just lucky if I got through some of those corners, the way I was doing it. So I've got to actually give it the respect, but try and be neat. Neat enough to carry the speed into the next corner, into the next one after that, and into the next one after that, and actually get the line right through the whole thing, really. And that's what makes a difference in the end. It's not actually the overall or gone through that one corner ridiculously quick. That doesn't really matter. If you've gone through ten terribly before it. So it's just about trying to keep it clean and listen to the co driver so I'll shut up and hopefully put a good surgeon. Bit wide into there, never mind, no massive time loss. Need to make sure we get these corners nice and tidy. These are time loss corners again if you don't get them right. Bit of time loss there for example. Just late and hesitant on the throttle because I was going wide on the exit. Into six left long tightens, turn heavy left. Opens flat to the best long 30. Six left and turn all right. 40. Six right to the crest, slow 50. Turn very tight. Do you know what I mean? Left. Going through there and actually breaking a little bit and just keeping it nice and tidy, really. 30. Not even trying to go that fast through it, but right freaks it. Uh, I'll put that extra corner in there that I like to put in every time. Four left tightens. I didn't tighten that much. There. I should control it there, just about. And they flipped it the wrong way then. Something should tickle bad otherwise. Turn unseen, three right. 
I'd like to chuck a few 360 in there, it turns out. Ah, I didn't expect that, I'll be honest. Oh, I'm going to restart because of that, that's bloody annoying. Wow. So, I think I got a bit carried away then. I started with the intention of keeping it clean and everything and then I started going a bit too fast. With a little one second analyst uh, analysing what I did there. This car is good though, I like it. I can really, really push it now I've uh, got used to it. Through there, for example, I was really slow through there first time around this stage. I don't remember. Turned in, I was too wide on the turn in. Wild to the third, the rear. 30. This is the corner, I keep messing up. Because I go through that corner and end up saying something, so I miss the call for that one every time. <laughs> That's probably what's happening. At least I didn't go around the circle this time on that corner. I actually got through it, but just went incredibly wide. I had a big entry slide going on there and it felt like it was going to go on me too much too early so I had a correction and then that just completely messed up the uh, timing for actually being able to get it into the apex with the slide going so I just ended up going to do deep and, uh, and by then I couldn't really salvage it on the brakes I was relying on the slide to slow me down and uh, do it for me so that's what went wrong in that one Oh, no, that's wide. Oh, no. Right. I've lost all concentration. <sighs> Let me give myself a minute. <laughs> oh, this is bloody hard. don't know why I do this to myself. I should just make a little video and edit it so it's all, just the, all the good bits. <sighs> do need to just keep quiet. I keep talking. I know it sounds easy, but I feel like when you're streaming, you should talk. And I end up waffling away, missing calls. I'm not saying that I'm absolutely perfect, and if I heard the call, I'd get it right, but it obviously gives me a better chance. So, silence is key for seven and a half minutes, hopefully under seven minutes. <laughs> Of a crest, it is six left. A 
Six right long, opens up a crest, 15, four left. Into don't cut three right long, of a crest. Keep right of a 40, three left. Into two right, very long, past junction. Opens 30, three right, 30. Cut four left of a crest. Middle of a 150, caution, four left of a crest, narrow. 30, keep middle of a crest, 50, five left, and six right, 30, six right, opens, keep middle of a crest, and a keep right into four left. 150. Oh god, that was an incredible course, a big crash. Right. To slow, six left, thirty, turn unseen, one right. Opens one hundred, turn unseen, square out. Sixty. No, turn, no, 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 no. Opens three long. Sudden turn two right, eighty. Turn one right long of a double junction. Opens into six left long tightens, turn heavy left. Opens flat to the oh, I keep frigging getting that corner wrong. Don't know why. Just get on the six power too early every time. So I remember to uh, rectify it next time round. Six right to the crest, slow 50, turn very tight heavy left. 30. Four right long, opens 19. Four left long, tightens 200. Flat left of a crest, last junction, 200. Slow, turn unseen, one right. No. Oh, oh. Luckily, the barrier just bounced me off there. Opens a crest. It's a six left. Fifty. Oh. Right. One more restart. Keep messing that same corner up. So what I'm going to do, a quick daily stage in between. feel like my concentration's gone for that now. We've been such a long stage, I need, need to be focused on it. So if we come back to it in a minute, after doing something else briefly, and I just have a bit of fresh focus for it. Find it does help going back to these things as well. Uh, do, 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 do. What's that? It's a, bit, it's a bit faster, so then when I come back onto it, it feels quite slow. Uh, my challenge, so just rally cross things. Uh, is that there any good ones? Uh, no fast ones, Jesus Christ. That's good, isn't it? Um, I guess I'll do that then. Just do this briefly, just to get me out of the restart mode. Con um, mentality, almost. 
No restarts in these. Oh, boom harder. Boom harder. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, that's steak. Boom harder, Germany. Quite like the Germany on Dirt Valley 1, and it's pretty much exactly the same on this, so. I love the way that the Dirt Valley 2 have just made us all buy a game that had like the only extra content they were going to add to it on it already and then they've just brought out as, a, as DLC all the content from Dirt Rally 1 that they've just enhanced and made feel a bit better or look a bit better or whatever whatever it's an absolute con but anyway <sighs> we'll get into that I could, uh, could last a fair while Oh, it's bloody dark, right, low shakedown and then into stage. Oh, it's a fast start. Oh, I knew that was coming. <laughs> Oops. I just locked up my brakes into the chicane. I've done it again? Oh, not quite. <laughs> Such a pro. Oh, I remember this stage from Derry Alley 1. With the wagon on the outside that corner there. I say I remember it. I don't remember it, I remember it. Oh. But certainly one that I, uh, I went through a few times. It's all tarmac. Sure, we're going right. Does seem different to the version of Dairy Alley 1. That was a good corner though, I used to love that corner. Then come through here, you drift all the way through this corner. In, uh, in the right car. Oh, excuse me. Oh, excuse me again. Might as well make it a triple, excuse me again. Yeah, right. Uh, <laughs> well, that went well. Terrible. <clears throat> but we'll crack on with this. Just distract us for a minute. Oh, I should have put the soft tyres on. Just distract us a minute from uh, from the time trial and then head back to it and see if I can just go back with a fresh head and actually get a decent staging without just considering restarting every two minutes. I hate it when I end up having these time trial events and trying to push and push and because of that you do just inevitably make too many mistakes you're driving outside of your skill level basically because you're trying to go faster and faster and faster so probably like your third or your second or third run through the stage is probably where your skill level should actually be and that's where you should probably leave it but then you come back and you attack it and you try and get higher and higher up the leaderboard and then you're just completely driving above your school, skill level the whole time but my theory is if you drive like that for long enough that becomes your skill level so in a way it's, uh, that's how I see it you can kind of improve from treating it like that because if you drive balls out all the time or you do for these um, actually known stages that you do in time trial events then you can just really 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 attack and it's just such a different thing from driving a stage when you can you, know, you can attack the corners and you can really like trust the co-driver's instructions because you know exactly what you're doing basically and all that kind of stuff it, it puts you on a different level and that becomes really really quite enjoyable I think one of the big challenges in this that not a lot of people, well I haven't heard a lot of people like really giving credit to to the difficulty is um, actually learning the co-driver's language because it's not quite as simple as it sounds to start off with there's a lot of detail in there when uh, when you listen to the co-driver properly and uh, it does like make a lot of sense when you follow what he says but it does get really quite complicated at times. It's not, it's, you have to compute what he said. It's not just like a, the four left and four right is the easy bit, but it's all the other little bits in between that you have to kind of compute that actually make the difference to being able to push again that, that bit harder. 
Anyway, obviously that's I'm not paying no attention to that right now because I'm just talking my way through it. But this is just a bit of fun, really. Well, everything's a bit of fun on this game. Oh god, the kick, the kick when you get the... You kind of get a bit of <laughs> oversteer, so you correct it, and then you get a kick back the other way. Like, bloody hell, that's even worse than the kick the other way or the other way. Does that made any sense? Oh, that was the right gear. It sounded like it was on a suddenly cruise then for a second. Oh. That was a good example of the crow driver's thing. That was opens, tightens, uh, the corner opened up on the exit of the first entry. So the first entry was a free left, I think, or free right. And uh, it opened up and then tightened after that. So it's just listening to that detail. Downhill, so we get the braking done nice and early. Not the fastest car, this we get 115 horsepower for a Mabrala, but it's um, it's certainly still a good challenge. It's a good rally car, and because it's front wheel drive, it's uh, I think it is anyway. Oh god, where am I going? Wrong way. Uh, because it's front wheel drive, it's a good challenge because of that as well, so it's not too difficult to drive. Obviously, I'm proving proving that wrong. I just remember which corner that is. I always used to catch me out on dirt rally one that. So this is a fast little section through the forest now if I remember rightly. That was a bit wide. Nearly finished. Last couple of corners. That's it. Uh, too easy. Well done. 24 seconds off the fastest guy that's been through that. Stage not finished. too bad, but well obviously done. not great either. You never know who these guys are. It could be bloody Sebastian Ogier. Alt Tanak, one of my uh, personal favourites. Coming good at the moment as well. He's hot. He's having a good time and uh, winning a few rallies. So it could be a season this year to play in the championship. Which will be good to see. Talking about the WRC here, if you're not familiar, which is the World Rally Championship. Uh, so let's head back to time trial and give it another bash, and hopefully make this a fast one and I'll my last one. Hey, <laughs> hey, great for a bit of rhyme in there. <laughs> this, I don't know why I came off here because this is no easy car to drive. Going back on it might be um, a bit tricky again. Even though it's only been about 5 minute break, 10 minute break, whatever it was. So, head down and try and get, get that time out of it. Hmm, <laughs> We're on the soft tyre, that's right. We need to be on the soft, I reckon. No, in fact, do we? Yeah, let's stick on the soft. I'd go into tuning the vehicle, but I don't... I don't know. I just get used to the car that I'm driving, so I don't know what I'd improve in a way. And I'll be honest, I'm a bit, I'm a bit bad for um, car tuning because of that. I just kind of get used to whatever it's set up like. And then I don't really see what's wrong with it after a while. So then I think, well, if I went into car tuning, what would I actually change? Feels fine now. Now I've got used to it. So maybe, uh, maybe that's just me, I don't know, but maybe I have to make the gear in a bit longer or shorter, probably shorter on this. 
That was good into there, nice and controlled. The shit out of it though. Oh, let's miss the trees. Bit of an excursion through the woods there. You see Ramirez, I saw him up a tree, I don't know if you uh, noticed it. He was up there, eating some uh, bird shit or something. Good to see Ray there. Questionable, <laughs> I better not say that. I'm just going to say, it. scout leader, that's all I'm going to say. All I'm gonna say. He might have a little bit of guilt if he was in the Catholic uh, Church in confession. I might find a few things out from Ray. That's all I'm going to say. I've got no evidence, obviously. It's just the fact that he's a scout leader. Oh, king of the scouts or whatever he is. Anyway, <laughs> anyway I've gone a bit off topic. I better show up. And donuts don't help my time either. So I'm going to go for that inevitable... I don't know why I just started waffling on about random crap there. Uh, right, do yourself a favour, just show up. Off the wall. Middle of a one fifty. Caution. Four left of a crest narrow. Thirty. Keep middle of a crest. Fifty. Five left. And six right. Thirty. Six right. Opens. Keep middle of a crest. And a keep right into four left. Oh no 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 no! Fucking goddamn! I just ignore my own bloody advice. As soon as I get like about 100 meters into the stage, I'm just pushing instead of driving it sensible. Five, four, three, this is my biggest problem, I think, on this game. Learning when to push and when not to push. When's the right time to actually proper push it? And when's the time to just sit back and go for the corners and make sure I'm nice and clean? And I, think, I don't really get that all that about rallying, it always seems like it's time to push for me. <sighs> right, my one last stage is coming up here right now, and it's going to be a time beater. I've said it now, so it's definitely not true. Oh, Ah, yeah, mm, bit of a problem with that last stage, last attempt. Uh, yeah, uh, might need another one. <laughs> Good job, the cars are uh, nice and cheap. If someone keeps paying to replace them. Nice guy. Or later, you never know. Don't do it again. Oh god, that was close as well. Four left. Into don't cut three right long of a crest. Keep right of a forty. Three left. Into two right. Very long. Pass junction. Opens thirty. Three right. Thirty. Cut four left of a crest. I don't know what to say. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Six left, opens of a crest. Into six right long of a crest, into six left. A six right long, opens of a crest, 50, four left. Into don't cut three right long of a crest. Keep right of a 40, three left. Two right, very 
head on. Pass junction opens. 30. Oh! Massive right. kick of oversteer. Oh! 30. Too much for. Oh, what is going wrong? Oh. <laughs> I feel like crying all of a sudden. Oh god, that was far too much for me to deal with on the steering wheel then. I didn't even do anything massively wrong, but ah, oh, just kick. You get kicked to the oversteer that you're not expecting. Uh, just so much to deal with all of a sudden mid corner. It's not like a little correction, it's all of a sudden it's like full opposite lock. And then it keeps back the other way, so it's full opposite lock the other way. You're trying to go through a corner, you know, you're either going to get the corner right when you're doing all that. So I need to slow it down and just keep nice and comfortable. I've done it again. Alright, I'm carrying on. Oh my god. I'm definitely having a restart. See me having a mental breakdown here, by the way. Someone phone uh, some kind of services to save me. You need to call the rally uh, Samaritans. There's probably people in this situation all the time. They just don't know what to do with themselves. The driving skills just deserted of all of a sudden. They don't seem they've got any chance whatsoever anymore. Where about half an hour ago they were doing quite well. Or reasonably well. Right, I've actually got the braking done for that corner. That's a good start. So we're away. Free flip. Wide again, Ooh. not too wide, but wider than I would have liked. Slow through there because I had a terrible line going through. Oh god, that was a bit close to the bail. Oh, for God's sake, why do I keep doing that? I keep spinning it. it. Just as soon as I go in first gear, I feel like I've, uh, I've, I've done the wrong thing, but it's, oh my god. Oh, now this is true, this bear you're witnessing. Oh, God's sake, man. By God's sake, man. Right, come on. I need to have a word with myself. Genuine attempt. I need a genuine attempt now. It's weird this day, really, too. Like I say, I got through Five, the stage first four, time. Three, Very slowly. Two, one, go. Six left. I suppose I just ignored those kind of mistakes and carried on, but... Let's actually get a stage under my belt. I really want it now. And I don't want to stop streaming till I've, uh, I've got another one and a faster one at that as well. like a pivot point on this guy, you just go past it and it's really difficult to bring it back with any kind of control in the corner that you're going through. Opens 
16. Oh, a bit late. Just wait for it to grip and then turn in instead of hitting the rocks. Uh, they logged even. Turn two right. 80. Turn one right long of a double junction. Opens into six left long tightens. Turn heavy left. Opens flat to a press long 30. Six left and turn four right. 40. Six right to a crest. Slow 50. Turn very tight heavy left. 30. Oh no. No, I can handle that. the bloody wall. Keep middle of a big jump. 50. Crest and 6 left of a jump. Oh. And this is where it all went wrong earlier. I better calm down a bit. Crest. That's better. Caution. Turn unseen. 3 right. 4 left. Opens long. No. 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 Ooh. It's a big mistake but Try to minimize the time loss. Six right, one hundred and fifty. Four right long, upwards of a jump. Into six right of a dip, a crest, caution, four left of a crest. Opens forty. Four left. Six to keep right of a jump and keep right of a crest. Thirty cut five left. Sixty six right and six left and three right tightens. Into four left of a crest opens thirty. Into four left, opens of a crest, 100, keep middle of a crest, jump, 50, six right long, no. just six left, oh. extra long, oh, 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 that was close. opens, into four right, no, do it. Titans of a oh, bridge tap long. on the tree, got away with it. Turn tight up in left. 
80. Oh no. Couldn't quite see where the hairpin was there, so I've gone very deep into it. <sighs> My eyes are straining a bit here now. It's a long one, like I keep saying. Oh no. Just a bit too much oversteer, got to be pointing in the wrong direction there. Managed to gather it up. Oh, that's not good. My hands are sweating, I'm sweating. Quite a bit of effort going into this. <laughs> Believe it or not. Oh, 7.15. That's 13 seconds I've knocked off then from my previous fastest time. Right, I'm just going to quickly whip my hoodie off because it's bloody whew, warm. <sighs> Bear with me a second. Yeah, it was pretty good. Enjoyed that, good stage that one. Don't know if it was actually any good. See what other people end up doing basically. After I've put in my fastest time, see if they, uh, they're a lot faster basically. Oh, turn that down. Yo, I'm a buy this game. You might as well, it's a good one. If you like rally games, it's not easy though. Don't, uh, don't suspect that it's easy, it's really not. <laughs> so if you haven't got the patience to put up with like learning a little bit and going through the stages and putting up with uh, disastrous driving at times then uh, it's probably not for you but if you like a bit of a uh, bit of good rally in action then it's pretty good anyway I'm going to leave it a bit of um, pretty much at that so do I have one more attempt I'll have one more attempt just for good measure uh, I'll go back to the view I prefer and then we'll have another go so 7.15 to beat now see if I can beat that I consider that pretty quick work I know it's beatable I'm not saying it's not beatable but it's pretty quick right that bloody first corner is a tricky one if you go give it the respect <laughs> little tip for anyone that's going to attempt this don't flat out for the first corner <laughs> You will hit the uh, hit the wall and go into the tree on the left hand side. Little lift about there, and then you're back on it all the way through. Oh, I was good into there then. Nice. Right. 30. Cut four left of a crest. I like this guy, it's good. Good button anyway. Probably not the quickest of all guys, but. 30. Keep middle of a crest. 50. Five left. And six right. Oh no, that's a bit oversteer it. <laughs> oh, covered that one just about. Carry on anyway. Don't bother us, so we're done with now. Opens 100, turn unseen square left. Oh no 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 no! Oh. Bloody god damn logs! Hate those logs on that exit. Turn right. Just keep finding me. It's not me finding them at all. Wide into the god. This is crazy driving. But we got through it. Let's we'll try and tidy it up a bit now. Done. That kick of oversteer when you just plant your foot in first, I can't quite get used to it. 
or how much you're gonna get, should I say, I can't quite get used to. Uh uh, Scandi flip. Not quite. Oh my god. See, I'm doing the opposite again. I'm just overdriving it. And that's where you start going wrong. My wrist is starting to hurt because bloody doing that much work. Oh. Five, four, three. Oh. In fact, I'll restart. So someone else uh, put a comment. Oh, there was another comment. Come on. Uh, da, da, da. I like racing games so I can catch on. Well, I like racing games as well. It is good catching someone on a track, but um, yeah, I just like driving all together, really. So I love my track driving, I love certain tracks, I love certain cars and all that, I absolutely adore it in a way, that's where my heart is in a way, but at the same time I can't help, I can't ignore rally games, they're really quite good these days and uh, I can't just be uh, sitting there thinking like, oh it's not worth playing, I want to give everything a go that's, uh, that comes out basically. In fact there's a European uh, truck racing game that's coming out sometime soon, in the uh, foreseeable future and uh, that looks pretty interesting I'll probably buy that so I just like any kind of simulation really or any kind of proper driving game and uh, Dirt Rally certainly gives you a driving game it certainly gives you an experience and it certainly gives you a challenge so it's worth playing in my eyes um, just purely for that you don't have to be massively into rallying or anything it teaches you a different way of driving as well. When you come off one of these rally stages, when you've driven like this, and you go back onto a track in a Ferrari or whatever, you feel like you're driving gold. You, any little bit of oversteer or anything, no problem all of a sudden. You might have been struggling with the traction control off or something. No, it doesn't matter all of a sudden. You play on this game for a little bit, and then all of a sudden you're, uh, you're not a driving god, don't, don't get me wrong. It, it just improves you. So, uh, a lot of this game's about throttle control, more than you think. It probably doesn't look like it when you watch people on these kind of videos booting it through the forest and stuff. But a lot of um, lot of the corner angle that you gain and the way that you go through the corners, as I uh, demonstrate a bad one, um, is a lot to do with your throttle control more than anything else. Uh, timing as well, timing's a big part of it where you turn in and the angle that you choose to put the car at and stuff at the right time. But, um, I'm doing quite well here, just talking my way through it. Um, but yeah, a lot of it is throttle control, I'll be honest. I think that's a big part of, uh, of a lot of racing, really. And when you can hone it as well as you can on this kind of game, because you have to, and then uh, when you go back onto track racing it just seems to play into your hands as uh, you're just that little bit better at throttle control basically and uh, a bit more willing to push the car in the corners and deal with a bit of oversteer or, or whatever you might cope with because of uh, your experience from these rally stages where it's absolutely ridiculous and you've got to catch everything in a split second if you want to if you want to stay on the uh, on the stage ah. So I've gone deep, but it's not a massive issue, I suppose. I'm not too slow. Lost about a second, two seconds there, maybe. Uh. Oh, nearly into the wall there. That was close. Turning early here, getting early apex, carry the speed through. Opens long, six left, over double jump, into cut by right. To keep left of a crest and keep middle of a crest at 50, cut six left long, 100. Gary going for wheel, it's pretty fast. Slow by right. Pretty neat and tidy though. Turn very tight Don't <laughs> full stop. 120. So, really matter on a hairpin, I suppose. Right. 
Puts up a crest. Not too bad for that. Happy with that. Keep middle of a big jump. 15. Crest. And six left of a jump. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. That's a bad one. So that's lost me quite a bit of time. At least I can hammer it down here now, there. Where I'd be lifting off and scared of wise. Got to make sure I get this car on the right at the same time, though. So that's better than I've done it before. So hopefully I've gained a bit of time, although I've just lost a bit of time before it. Oh, a big catch me corner there. No, too close to the wall. Had to get it. Hammered on the brakes there to control it. Make sure that I wasn't going to have a massive um, moment. No. No. Too wild. No. Roll. Roll. Carry on. Oh, I've stalled it. Start, start, start. Oh, right. Oh, it felt like it was right at the end. But looking at this top left, it's not. So, this is my last attempt for now anyway, so I'll carry on anyway, but obviously it's not going to be a faster one anymore. I wouldn't have thought so. It'd be pretty crazy if it is. I must have been pretty slow last time round if it is. Pushing now though, that's, that is the difference. It's good there, I'm enjoying it. Even though I've just had that massive roll. Oh, 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 oh. I thought we were going to get away with that one. We just pull it back slowly, but that would have been a right moment on the replay. I would have uh, watched the replay just to watch that corner back if that was... Uh, if I'd have got away with that one point. So get it, oh, just keep... I'm just being a bit too aggressive 18. now. Anyway, <laughs> I've jiggled my camera around, I've just realised my bloody wheels aren't even on the screen. Keep left of a jump. Into four anyway, I've pretty much ruined this stage, but just have a bit of fun towards the end now then. Just try and handbrake it as much as possible. Get it a bit sideways. I'll go early on this. Oh no, hit that barrier there, just hit me into the wall. It's a bit of a shame. So really, it's at these last corners now, see how aggressive it can be, knowing that we can crash and it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Jesus, can you imagine if I got away with that then, that would have been awesome. <laughs> oh, just been a bit too uh, aggressive. Hey, oh. Finish this stage. 752. It wasn't actually that bad, even though I had a massive roll in there. Not too bad, anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 715, I suppose. Yeah, it was pretty bad. Um, right, what am I going to do? Quickly, just going to bear with me a second. Uh, da, 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 da. Here we are, back. So, you can see your comments now, what is it? His name? Dirt Rally 2, that's the name of the game. Uh, GTR 3, be an amazing game. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure what you mean by that, I'm afraid. We've gone to his most but obviously, it's a good game. Uh, anyway, I never quite like it when the... Uh, so the screen's cut down a little bit, but never mind. Five, I'll deal four, with it. Three, two, one, last, last attempt, so then I'm going to call it a do.
Mm, maybe I'll have a restart. <laughs> God. What the hell is going on? Uh, I better not do that all the way through now. Slightly uh, different perspective. Because I'm not in the middle of the screen anymore anyway. My car's off to the left a bit, it feels a bit weird. Let's try and beat that time. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't think I can have the comments on. <laughs> I've done this before and I really struggled. Right, let me just turn those comments back off. Sorry about that. But I can't really manage it. I need a bigger TV, if anything. Feel free to uh, send me a load of money for a bigger TV. Oh. Forgot that I've just crashed, so I restart. Anyway, right. Genuine last attempt. Full screen. Stop messing about. Stop talking and put a bit of concentration and effort into it. Six left. Opens of a crest. It is six right long of a crest. It is six left. A six right long. Opens of a crest. Fifty. Four left. It a don't cut three right long of a crest. Keep right of a forty. Three left. To two right, very long, pass junction, opens 30, three right, 30, cut four left of a crest, keep middle of a 50, caution, four left of a crest, narrow, 30, keep middle of a crest, no. 50, oh, for Fried egg sick. <sighs> really? 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 I can't hit my bloody button. Really? Yes. <sighs> I hate this game. I really do. Passionately hate it and like it at the same time. I guess it's like being in one of them relationships with uh, someone who beats you but you can't leave them or something. Because you love them too much, but they beat you every night. Must be that kind of similar thing, that's what I'm going to compare it to. It's like being in a, in a domestic abuse relationship. Oh my god. I just keep getting abused. I don't manage to get much, much abusing back. Right, anyway, stop waffling on talking shit and concentrate on getting a good surgeon. I lose my mind doing this. I end up thinking about all sorts. Phil's voice falls, mate, the car driver. Should be able to download your own car driver voice, uh, like you could you do on sat nav uh, when everyone knew to do it. So you could have a famous voice or whatever on, uh, on your car driver. Be quite good. Or even do the notes yourself. Have a full rally game where you've got to do the recce, recce, uh, the recce and actually do your own notes with a car driver and all that kind of stuff. He might suggest something, but you might suggest another note that you think's more appropriate for it or something like that. Not sure how it'd work, but that would be the ultimate in rallying. Actually doing the notes and the recce and with the uh, car driver as well. Obviously, be incredibly difficult, but give you a chance to make your own notes. So obviously, you could make them how you like. If there was a, a certain instruction, like for God's sake, get the braking right for that one that you wanted to add in, then you could do it, I guess. Make sure you don't go wide, otherwise you're going to die. Or into this one. Watch out! This is a bad boy corner. And he's gonna kill you. All that kind of stuff. Be interesting. <laughs> be interesting to see what everyone's notes will be like. Just managed to scrappily get through that bit without breaking my wrists. Feel like there's a half snap though. Feels like there's a bit of a, a fracture going on. Definitely got to build up your wrist muscles before you just chuck yourself into full feedback mode. Quite high up on the dirt rally too. There's only one way most males know to um, 
strength from the wrist muscles. I've gone the wrong way again. And that's uh, polishing those go karting medals that they might have won. Obviously. My ghost is in front of me now, I'm, I'm serious all of a sudden now. Oh, Mr. Ghost has come to chase me. So, I'm slower than I was, which is no good for me. Oops, I keep getting that corner wrong. I had that corner absolutely delightful a few time round, but seems like the instruction's too late for me now, whether I'm going a bit too fast into that section or what, I don't know. Well, the fact that I'm talking the whole way through it. Again, when I said I wouldn't, can't help it. No, oh, a bit wide on the old exit, but we're catching up to the ghost. It's an important thing, let's carry some speed through here. Catch a bit of the uh, grass down here as well. Get turned in nice and early, carry the speed. Oh no, carried it a bit too well to the inside. Oh, for right. Six left. Fish finger sandwich, save. Try not to swear, hence why I try and make up something beginning with F every time. Just in case you're thinking I'm a bit odd. You're right, I am, but I try not to swear too much. Because uh, I want anyone to kind of be able to watch these videos if they want to. Not just you uh, old folks. Not that any kids need to watch these videos, they're probably far better than me. Six year olds probably uh, putting in times that I could only ever dream of. Oh, I tell you right, I think I'm pretty much done. <laughs> My wrists are going to snap if I carry on much longer. Oh, it's a hell of a car to drive, I've really, really enjoyed that. Um, maybe it's gone on a little bit too long, so I haven't enjoyed it in the end, but. Uh, I'm happy with my stage time for now, 7.15 I think it was in the end and um, yeah, I'll pretty much leave it at that. Uh, give it a go yourselves if you're interested in joining the group, it's the Mature Racing Club on Facebook uh, for Dirt Rally 2. Uh, join up um, and um, introduce yourself maybe or whatever and have a go at the time trial event or whatever events they put up it's up to you what you have a go at you don't have to there's no obligation to enter anything you can just enter you can just join the group on facebook and keep an eye on everything and see what other people are doing uh, and along with that there's another one called crash and burn, uh, crash and burn uh, dirt rally 2 group for facebook so uh, go check that out as well they're also do time trial events and people posting videos and all that malarkey uh, set up information on there if you want it there's people out there that are incredibly fast in some of these groups um, and I mean incredibly fast so you can ask advice from them and try and pick the brains see if they'll uh, tell you anything to, to help you out uh, most people are pretty friendly in these groups and they don't mind being contacted and uh, and having a bit of a chat with everyone so yeah anyway I'm just trying to encourage you if you haven't already and you're into this kind of stuff you've just been playing along on your own get involved in one of these groups and uh, you can compete against other people you don't have to talk to anyone or anything like that if you don't want to but it just gives you uh, other people that you can make friends with and possibly end up chatting with in the future. Anyway, without much further ado, it's uh, it's goodbye. So thank you very much. I've been Eddie G. I've enjoyed that one, but it's bloody frustrating at the same time. Uh, I'm sure you appreciate that. It's it's infuriating going through one stage almost. It's almost a, a godsend going through one stage on its own without um, repeating it and repeating it because you can just forget about it after you've done it if you make a few mistakes it's over and done with that's it but when you're repeating it and repeating it you just constantly get caught up on your mistakes and it becomes a bit of a torturous experience so uh, anyway hopefully you understand that when you're watching these and uh, you bear with it thank you very much for if you have done excuse me i've been adg uh if you've enjoyed this subscribe and uh, give us a like if you've liked it thank you very much and see you again goodbye enjoy the rest of your day